Take a look at this paragraph. In HTML, we can create paragraphs using what's commonly known as the P tag, or the paragraph tag. You'll find that this P tag is one of the easiest tags to write, but also one of the tags that you'll be writing the most, and one of the most important tags. So we'll show you now below how to write a P tag. So here we have a very simple paragraph that has not been enclosed in a paragraph tag. And here we have another small paragraph, also not enclosed in a paragraph tag. Let's run this and see what happens. As you can see, both paragraphs have been placed on the same line. They run together. Now let's show what it would look like if we added the P tags. So we'll add a P tag here and a closing P tag here. Remember to create the P tag, just an open or a, well, an open and closed tag, but we want to focus on the fact that this is a greater than sign, less than sign, and we'll put the P in the middle. This makes a P tag. The same is true for the closing P tag other than the fact that we have a forward slash, which indicates that the paragraph is closing or ending there. Now let's do this again. The P tag to start out, the opening P tag, and now the closing P tag. We'll run this. Notice each paragraph has now been placed on its own line, a separate paragraph. And if we were to say, let's say we wanted to add more content, we'll just copy this paragraph and paste it here. We'll paste it again, just to give some more, some more weight to that paragraph. Let's run this. Notice the paragraphs, they stay separate. But again, if we were to remove these paragraph tags, even if we had separations all throughout our document, let's say we were to separate this line from this line, and again this line, without the paragraph tags, this is what would happen. It would all become one paragraph. But if we add those paragraph tags back, We'll just do some quick copying and pasting. Then we run it. They become four separate paragraphs. This is how the paragraph tag works. So be sure and visit learntolearn.com forward slash HTML where you can watch these same videos on HTML as well as practice what you're learning as you're watching the video.